This is Dabu 7. And it looks like the death of the dollar has begun here full steam. There has been this slow erosion of the dollar and its purchasing power for many, 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 many years. But now it looks like the petrodollar, the reserve currency status that the U.S. dollar has held for a long time, is coming to an end in rather quickly. This has been talked about by many different experts out there. Zoltan had talked about this. Goldman even predicted it and said that we are, are approaching the end of the dollar's reserve currency system. A lot of people want to stick their head in the sand and ignore this. That's to their own detriment. You need to prepare for what's coming because this is going to this is going to rattle the lives of everyone out there, especially anyone sitting on large amounts of US dollars. What this what this is going to end up doing is sending all these US dollars back to the United States. And if you think inflation's been bad thus far, you haven't seen nothing yet. Now China and Brazil have just struck a deal to ditch the U.S. dollar. It used to be that the United States went around the globe enforcing the dollar at the barrel of a gun. Well, they're not doing that in these situations. They're basically laying down and they're letting the dragon advance on this world stage. For those that just can't seem to get it, it's because the world is a stage. All the world leaders have come together and sold the people out of every country. And until you wrap your head around that, you're going to be lost. Okay? The rest, they're just playing out for the history books. Theaters of war. Now, if you go back and do your research, you will see that everything was staged. A whole ran was put into motion by J.P. Morgan Chase for the first Great Depression. Their meetings on Jekyll Island. We're heading right back down that road here as our politicians have sold us out. They know this is coming. They know that this is the end game, and they're walking us right toward it. They're not doing anything to counter these moves out in the world stage, but there's really not anything they can do. Okay, China and Brazil striking this deal to ditch the U.S. dollar is absolutely huge. The next massive move is Saudi Arabia. And this is really where it all lies, because our deal with Saudi Arabia and the petrodollar is what gave us this power all this time. Now it's going away. Saudi Arabia has just joined China's economic security bloc, where Russia is a member also. And this is because China is playing a peacemaker. And I warned you about this. Everyone was thinking peacemaker in Israel, Trump and all this. Well, the real guy going around the globe right now trying to strike peace is the dragon, Xi Jinping. Sure enough, the dragon. And he is striking up a peace deal between none other than long enemies. Iran and Saudi Arabia, bringing them into one team. Again, most of the people out there don't even begin to understand the magnitude of all this. They will a year or two down the road when they're like, what happened? And they fail to listen to the writing on the wall. And this is what's going, going on here. In gold, expect once these rigged markets are exposed, the precious metals are going to go to astronomical levels that you've never seen. You think the crypto was wild. You just wait till the metals take off. There won't be no coming back down for them, though. So get ready. There are predictions that within the next 30 days, you are about to see a series of events that are going to change everything. The way that everything flows, where it all goes. And if they set up this disaster, well, they can swoop in and have the answer which is their CPDC, they're going to do so. So get ready. That is the plan. I break this down further in, in greater detail on the live streams. Join me there where I got more time to talk about it. Monday and Friday, 9 p.m. Eastern, Dabu 777. Make sure to hit that subscribe button for more.